Year 9 Biology. Welcome. Are you excited for a fun learning session? Make sure you have your book and a pen before we start. Today you are going to learn about biodiversity, genes and extinction. The adaptations that an organism has are controlled by its genes. The organisms with adaptions that are most suited to its environment are more likely to survive and pass on the successful adaptations. If there are changes to the environment that an organism lives in can mean that it is no longer adapted to its environment. This can lead to large amount of organisms dying out or becoming extinct. Environmental changes that can lead to extinction can be caused by natural means or through human activity. Changes that can lead to extinction include, hunting slash fishing from humans habitat destruction from logging slash building diseases competition from other organisms. These new organisms may have moved in naturally or been introduced by humans changes in temperature slash water levels etc. Organisms compete with other organisms for resources, such as food or space. The organisms that are able to outcompete other organisms are more able to survive and reproduce and over time this can lead to the extinction of the less competitive species. Biodiversity is the amount of organisms that live in a certain place. If one organism is lost then this can have a knock-on effect on the food chain and can have consequences that are far-reaching. In order to prevent this there are different steps that can be taken to prevent the loss of organisms. In order to prevent the loss of species there are a range of different things that can be done including, setting up nature reserves banning hunting or fishing of protected species set up, breeding programs preserving habitats preserving the seeds of endangered plants and the gametes of endangered species for future cloning or breeding purposes.